Hello again, interwebs. Welcome back. My name's Tethys. Today we're continuing our playthrough of Stardew Valley. Sorry for not posting the last couple days. I've been dealing with a uh, pretty bad cold. I'm still kind of getting over it, but I thought I was in good enough shape to continue doing some playthroughs, so we'll get on that. Okay, festival tomorrow. And we've got our plants growing. So let's get those water. And then if I remember correctly, we were saving up for is the chicken coop. So I think that's kind of going to be the main focus after we go and return Robin's axe. And we need our tools. So that and that. Why? Well, because I want to get this place cleared out. Plus, it also gets us our um, gathering experience that we need in order to be more proficient with this axe, which, I, if I recall, means that we're either better at chopping down trees or we get better um, or a higher amount of uh, resources when we chop them down. And unlike on my main file, I would like to keep this area pretty tree-free, because otherwise it becomes a pain in the butt to clear out later. I would like to get that, um, greenhouse, because I actually did just get it on my, um, my own file, and it's awesome to have, because it's quite, quite, um, big on the inside. So you can pretty much grow anything in there, I think, any time of the year that you want, which is especially useful during the winter. Alright, so we got that cleared. Let's go and grab our sickle. And then we can start gathering fiber and hay, because we're going to need hay. That doesn't look like it's gathering any. Odd. Although I don't think we start gathering hay until we either have a place to put the hay, like a silo, or until we have animals to feed it to, which is kind of annoying if that's the case. Oh, we got one little tree here. Alright, let's go and give Robin her axe, because that'll give us, what, 250? I think it's 250. No, I don't need anything built. I'm giving you your axe. And that's 250, yep. Why do I get the feeling I've done this before? Okay. So, we need... 4,000 for that coop. At the moment, we don't really have a lot of money, which makes it kind of difficult. Let's go and get these geodes cracked open. Because they might end up providing something at least worth selling. 
Otherwise, it'll end up going into the uh, museum. No, I don't want to gift it. Process my geodes. Yay. Celestine. And that's selling. Calcite. Sandstone? Sandstone. Alright, uh, let's go and make sure that nothing needs to get put into the ooh, um, collection, the museum. What it does. Sandstone, Celestine, and the cal- the calcite? Yeah, calcite. And collect. Ooh, melon seeds. Awesome. And we are in summer, and we can plant those, so we are going to plant those. After... Get rid of that. Oh right, and I forgot that our tulips bloomed. And if I recall correctly, we don't need them for anything in the community center. Uh, let's see. Nothing there. Could do the construction bundle. Fall foraging, spring foraging. Wait, are we in spring or summer? I'm pretty sure we're in spring, actually. Yeah, we're in spring. What am I thinking? And we can't do anything in the crafts room. Okay, so we need... We got the horseradish. Got the dandelions. We need the leek and the daffodil. Otherwise, we can sell these tulips. So let's get rid of those. And we're not going to plant the melons because it's not summer. In the meanwhile... Ugh, I keep forgetting that's there. Ooh! The traveling cart's here. What do you got? Oh, they've got truffle? Shoot, I wish I had the money for that, because that would be such a huge pain in the butt taken care of for the community center. Ugh. Well, hopefully we've come across a leek and a dandelion. Or a daffodil, I mean. Because that would be very nice. I'll quickly turn that down a little bit. There we go. There's a horseradish. Now, I don't know for certain if entering and exiting an area of the town itself will cause things to respawn, like it does in the- oh, I guess it kind of does. Alright. Well, that is extremely useful to know. Because then in that case, I'm going to be able to keep an eye out for things spawning that weren't usually there. Unless I just picked up the thing that we saw earlier. I'd like to get a better axe so that I can get past that um, hardwood. Huh. Looks like we're not having that much luck in terms of finding leaks or a... Um, 
daffodil, which is... Oh, wait, there's a daffodil. One. All right, now I need just the leak now, which I think is going to be the biggest pain in the bot. But if we can do that, we can get the first bundle done. Check up over here. I don't think there's anything over here. We can't do anything about that bridge yet. Oh, you can. I didn't realize you could forge around in the bushes. That's new to me. Hello! Oh. Deeper in the mine. Reached level 40. Those are all the in enemies we need to kill in the mines. Silver Saber. I can't remember, I think that might be slightly better than what we have. And if not, then... Whatever. One other part we haven't looked at is up here. What's that say? Railroad. Well, can't go that way. How do I even get to the railroad? There's the carpenter's shop. Is the railroad just blocked? I think it is. Which kind of sucks. Because I know that there's stuff up there, most likely. But, let's go and drop off the stuff that we do have. So we can get those marked off, and I can sell whatever else we come across, aside from leaks. Bundles them up all not nicely. Okay. So fingers crossed we find a leak tomorrow. Because I think that bundle opens up the other bundles. Or the, um... Not the other bundles, the other parts to put bundles in. But for now, the day is almost done. Oh, we also didn't look up here, did we? Mm. No leaks. Oh well. Off to bed we go. <sighs> Not bad. Not bad for starting. Get out of there! God damn it. I need fiber. How much fiber do I have? 17? I need 20. Well, that would explain where the other ones went. Got eaten by a crow, I didn't even think of that. I'm a dirt. Journal updated. Advancement. Yay! Let's just throw this right on in here. Oh, I didn't water the tulips yesterday, did I? Shoot. Yeah, that's what I thought. Alright. Well, we gotta go down here and water these two. Done, and then we'll go and go for foraging again. Oh, 
once the cauliflower finishes growing, it'll bring in a decent amount of money. I don't think it'll get us the money we need for the coop completely, but it'll get us quite a decent amount. Yes, Kitty, I, I am bringing you water. There you go. You are a very cute kitty. Alright. Now. Let's head on down. And hopefully... We can find a leak. And uh, the reward for that will just be like a package of uh, spring seeds containing seeds for the things that we've actually been foraging, so... Not a huge gift, but... Alright, the egg festival has started. I don't know if I want to go do that, though. Like, I don't really have anything that'll... necessarily be worth taking. Actually, I don't think you need to take anything. Dandelions, sell those. I just, just want to find a leak. Not dandelions. Find them any other time, but now when I'm looking for them, it's usually how it works. Well darn, let's go to the festival then. Strawberry seeds. In spring. Hmm. You know what? Let's do it. We're gonna grab them. See my nose. I also can't get lined up. Ah, there. That's as good as it's gonna get. I think everybody's ready. Okay, so we're gonna look for eggs here. And I think we get a star fruit for a reward. Or something decent at least. Yeah, we're ready. Running! There's an egg. There's another egg and another egg. And I think that's an egg down there. Grab that. That. There's another one, and another one. Oh, and another. No, I don't care. Got it! Oh, and there's like two up there. Crap. Little oh, fingers crossed. Look at all these eggs. Now, if only I could get you kids to pick up this litter from uh, litter this efficiently. We're the cleanest town this side of the Gem City. And now the winner of this year's egg hunt. Me, please. Yes. 
I get a straw hat. Well... Screw you. I worked hard for that. This is my reward. I feel... I feel shafted. I've been shafted. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Do I have enough resources for another scarecrow? Wood and fiber. This will give me enough wood. Now I just need the fiber. Come on. I want to get this done before it gets too late. 11. 12. 13. 14. 15. 16, 17, 18. There we go. Perfect. And then we shouldn't have to worry about any of our stuff going missing overnight. But I will be putting it closest to the strawberries because those, I think, are going to sell for the most. And let's head off to bed. Alright, what's the TV say? Queen of Souls. Coleslaw! Ugh. I don't like coleslaw personally, although cabbage tastes awesome. Very happy today they will do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Well, once we get all the plants watered, we'll hit the mines because that is a great day to do it. Because it should make it so that we're coming across better stones and stairs and geodes. Definitely gonna need the energy. Acorn pine and whatnot. Also a good thing to do is hit these. Now if I could just find more trees. may have made some bars, and if not, then we're just going to try and go as far down as we possibly can. 
maple seeds. We do have the wild horseradish that we can eat too, and the algae, so it's not like we don't have the resources. We do we did manage to get a couple out of that. Okay, so let's quickly empty out anything we don't need. That. Since we're here, let's just quickly make sure. And the reason I'm going the long way is because I want to make sure that we come across a leak if we if we do. And there's a higher chance of us coming across a leak if we go the long way because there's more grass. One. That's all I need. Just one. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Oh well. In we go. Floor 20. We want to get to 40. And this area is infested. Although, thankfully, this won't require us to use any, any energy. And we found an earth crystal. Say. It's not getting back, that's eh, eh, eh. Down we go. Ooh! Amethyst. Now let's get rid of these little guys. Okay. There's some copper. Nope. 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 Oh. oh, a rock lobster. Oh. And some copper. Oh, stairwell. Right, down we go. Okay, so these things need to go right now. Oh, stairwell. Back, back, back. Nothing over there, some copper over here. Copper over here. Quartz, copper. Oh, let's kill these. The reason I'm killing these is because it'll give us uh, the um, more on the checklist at the Adventurer's Guild. We do get rewards for finishing them, so it is worth it. I just can't remember what the reward for killing the bugs is. Well, we're trying to get to floor 40, so... here, so it's literally just looking for a stairwell. And if I could just get lucky and find one, that'd be awesome.
Oh, a geode. Some copper. And a box with sap. Yay. No. Not going in your shell. Quartz, quartz, copper. And this lime. Oh, iron ore. Interesting. Didn't I didn't remember uh, getting it around this level yet. Although that's probably just the high luck. Oh my god, give me a stairwell, please! Well, gotta eat it. I wasn't aware algae made a crunching sound. Thank you. I'd like to at least get to 30 so that we could do it on another day. Ooh, amethyst. More monies. More buggies. Oh, crap. Earth crystal and a chewing stick. That's an artifact. We'll take that in as well. The red mushroom. Can't recall what those are for. Oh, a little. A cherry bomb. Awesome. I find that um, later on in the caves, or the mine, I mean, it really doesn't matter too much that you can't see, uh, see because it doesn't get dark. Like these levels, it's dark, but you don't find it getting that dark later on. Okay, another quartz and earth crystal. Grab that and we do a quick round up here. No. Okay, nothing left. Good. That gets us to floor 30. Right before a big thing of uh, monsters attacks. Okay, sweet. Lots of copper. Oh, and bats. Great. Back, 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 back. Now, is there anything worth grabbing here? Oh my god! I forgot those little things that are down here. Die, die, die. Nothing. 
We're not gonna waste a cherry bomb because we already have a stairwell. If we get to 35, that'd be even better. Okay, so we're just gonna... Oh my god. Time to go! Whew. Okay, so we did get to floor 30, which is what... I was hoping at least at the end would be the case. So I can't complain too much. And then we got a bunch of copper, which is gonna be awesome, because then we can start upgrading our weapons once we have the money. So we'll quickly run over to our little box, and throw in the stuff that we got. So we got that, and that, and that, and that, and that, and that, and that. Need one for the mining thing. And we do need the... Uh, no, we don't need the buck meat. Alright. Yes, I know we're tired. Alright, so before we end this episode, let's see what we get. Probably not a whole lot, but we did get a thing in combat and... Oh, mining. Sweet. The miner's treat's awesome. Oh, not bad. Almost a thousand. Sweet. Alright guys, thanks for watching. This has been Stardew Valley. I hope you enjoyed. If you liked what you saw, please leave a comment in the comment section below letting me know what kind of games you'd like to see me play next, as well as any games you'd like me to play while I'm playing this in Resident Evil. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching. Bye! He likes maple syrup, so...